Hey everyone, welcome to the teacup. This is Age Graceful. Welcome. So glad that you guys could stop by. Before I begin, I just want to thank everyone again for stopping by on Sunday afternoon and participating in my live stream where I did a collaboration with Sandra from the SoulfoodQueen.net channel and I did a patty melt. She's going to be doing one uh, one day next week, I think either Tuesday or Wednesday. She hadn't quite decided, but you guys look out for that. So moving forward, I wanted to share an important warning with you guys. Something that somebody had um, brought my attention to, one of my co-workers. So I wanted to share it with all my subscribers. And it is because of TM, who is one of the best confectionists I've ever seen in my life. She has a YouTube channel. She suggested that I bring this information to you guys. Um... If you get a chance to go to her channel, you will see the best looking candied apples, candied pears, candied peaches. She does chocolate, strawberries, chocolate grapes, all types of party favors and cakes. Really beautiful channel, really beautiful lady. So check her out if you get a chance real soon. So moving on to this warning and important story. Um, there was a woman and she was out for the day and had stopped for gasoline. While she was at the pump, a man approached her and asked her if she would like uh, his services. He was a painter and she looked at him and he happened to be in the car with another gentleman and she declined his services. However, he did have a business card and she took the card out of courtesy and respect. So she got into her car and she began to drive. She hadn't been driving very long when she felt very tired, sleepy. She couldn't hardly breathe. And so she kind of let the window down a little bit so she can get some air. And she happened to notice that this car was still following her. So her women's intuition kicked in real quick and she turned down a street and she whipped up into a driveway. She didn't know whose driveway it was, but she just whipped in and she laid on that horn. I mean, she laid into it uh, because she needed help. Well, the guys in the car they saw that she had pulled into a driveway. They didn't, know, they didn't know if it was her driveway or not. So they kept going. And come to find out, the car that she had accepted, it had a substance on it that penetrated the pores of her skin and got into her bloodstream and had overcome her. Oh, my gosh, these people are getting more and more ruthless each and every day. These guys had the full intentions on taking advantage of her and God knows what would have happened. So like I said, the card had a substance on it that she was able to verify later. So, more of the story, story, ladies and gents, and tell your children as well. Do not accept anything from anybody off of the street. And we're getting ready to go into warmer weather now. People are going to start to canvas the neighborhoods. Don't go to the door taking things from people. If they have something to offer you and you did not call them, you did not hook up with them through word of mouth or through the yellow pages. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I said yellow pages. I said it earlier, too. And it was so funny. Uh, the people in my age group, they said, OK, you really reach back for that one, the yellow pages. But you can Google things. You can use Angie's List or other subscription services to find 
the people that you need for the services that you want at your house, be it plumbing, heating, cooling, roofing, masonry work. I mean, even planting flowers. You know, if somebody comes to your door and they want to hand you something, like I said, have them put it in your mailbox. You can put on gloves and look at it later. Or if they want to shake your hand before they leave, tell them no. Tell them you just got off the toilet. You know, don't shake their hand. Tell them anything. Do not shake their hands. I mean, I know everyone has also heard about uh, recently the young lady who called for an Uber and the person who showed up to her house and she actually got into their vehicle they uh, drove away with her and ended up murdering her. So make sure your children know too. I mean, when I was coming up, it was uh, a rule. You do not even talk to a stranger, you know. So educate your children on this. And I'm just so glad that the lady had the intuition and the wherewithal to like, even through her cloudiness figure that something was not right and um, you know pull over in time enough to uh, get some help so um, just be careful guys I had to come on and tell my age graceful subscribers because I want you guys good I want you guys to be all right okay so thank you for stopping by and listening to my commentary. I appreciate you all. You guys have a beautiful evening, afternoon, or day, depending on what time you happen to listen to this. All right. And I will talk to you again real soon. You guys take care. Bye now.